So I got done with the gym and now I'm looking, I came to the Acme which is next door and I'm looking for syrup because I got organic waffles, but I want maple syrup. Here we go, certified organic maple syrup. $12. I'm not sure if this is the right kind, but it's organic, so I'm gonna get it. I'm sure Daniel will like it. And it's like we're gonna use it a lot. This will last for a long time. I don't know. Yeah, I'll just get this. Hi. We have a special breakfast today. I have scrapple, some bacon, and over easy eggs. She has scrambled eggs, and she has waffles, and we got, well, she got organic maple syrup. How do you guys say syrup? Do you say syrup or syrup? Well, I'm going to try it. This is the organic waffles with um, flaxseed. Good? Can I try a piece? It's all in the you know. Tastes like I go. <laughs> it's very good. Um, oh yeah, I got right, my raw milk right here. So I wanted to show you guys what we changed in our um, sunroom. Let me clean up Minnie's mess though. She loves this rug and every morning the sun will um, cut, like shine on the rug so she lays but now I guess it's just getting to be too little. There's only a little tiny patch left. That's my foot so you can see it's like really not that much sun left. But she always has her toys in like a blanket and like goes over there. But um... No checks. No? Junk mm -hmm. mail? Stupid junk mail. You should call them. So what we figured was Danny has a lot of health books and stuff. Not only for school, but like for his own it's not a lot in there either, actually. enjoyment or whatever. We haven't put a lot in there, but like he has a lot of books that he's going to use like eventually for his career and just his own whatever. So we got a bookshelf and we put it in this corner. If you remember, this lamp was kind of just randomly sitting in the corner, like, awkwardly. Um, these are sunflowers that I bought myself. <laughs> they're real. So they're there, too. And I just filled this frame, which we got as a wedding gift. And it says, Our Wedding, A Celebration of Love. And I just picked a few pictures to put in there to display. Um... So we're just keeping it simple, but we I think it makes the room look a lot more full and more like homey. It was kind of empty. And we'll put a picture right here too. But for now, there's just the one picture. But um yeah, it kind of like pulls the room together more and makes it look more complete. I have to water the plants. But why are you crying? Is it because you're ready for your second meal? Minnie gets four little meals a day, so she's it's about her time. Do you want to eat? Puppy kibbles! You have to see how excited. She gets so excited right when I open this. Minnie! She knows exactly what it means. <laughs> oh. Do you want your second meal? You want brunch? One and a half tablespoons for the mini girl. Brunch. One. And she devours. So I got my hair cut. Um, I got layers. I got long layers. So my long or my shortest layer is pretty much at my chin. Um, so I just like kind of decided I wanted a change, and I just thought it was it like it. I think it complements a lot of people's faces and stuff. So I decided to get that, and 
Yeah, so Danny and I are gonna go out to dinner for a date night. Um, and I'm looking because we're gonna print out a coupon off of Oh, so yeah, we're going out to dinner. I feel like I kind of cut myself off short earlier. When, like, not that earlier, but when I was talking about my hair. So, um, as you can see, I got layers. Um, nothing drastic. Um, I didn't do anything to the length, just a trim, like a healthy trim. And yeah, so I feel like it really, I'm looking in the mirror as I talk because... I like keep looking at it. I feel like it really shapes my face and um, I think layers really do complement a lot of people's faces. So um, if you have a good hairstylist, which I've been going to the same hairstylist since I was about three years old, then definitely um, go for it. I know it's kind of scary and it's kind of annoying to do your hair when you have layers, but it's definitely worth it in the end. I really like it and it's thinned my hair out. She used the razor on it and everything. I don't know. Let's see what Danny thinks. What do you think of my hair? Hi. What do you think of my hair? I like it. You said it's not too different, but it's different. Like, like it doesn't look a lot different. Like if I just look at you for a second, but it looks good. Like it looks better. It's like you know. Yeah. yeah. Where are we going? To your house. Well, after that. Carabas. And then what? Oh, uh, back here. Watch a movie. Yeah. Look at how many. What are these celery? Those are that were in my salad, and they fell over too. We don't like them. We do not like celery at all, and it was so much. How was your tilapia? Good. There could have been more sauce on it though. But it was good. And broccoli. Super excited that there's broccoli today. I know, it's like seasoned really well. Garlicky. We're gonna split now. I'm gonna beat you out. You didn't close the door. <laughs> I'm gonna beat you out. Look, a hot air balloon. Why is there a hot air balloon? Can't really see it in the camera. There you go. Now you can see it. I want to go in a hot air balloon. You would never go in a I would never go in a hot air balloon. You know you the one thing that you're scared of is heights. Why? <laughs> So this is my favorite store. Just getting some batteries. Look at all those. I got to the car first. Yeah, I was here waiting and it was locked and I couldn't get in. Why? Because you locked it and I don't have my keys. Whoa, I don't have my keys. So then I was walking around Harbor Freight with a box of Roster. Just unlock it. Oh, it's not. <laughs> and we still need blackberries for our wine. Oops, that was locking it. Yeah, yeah. So you can run into the shop, right? Because I um, want to read. There we go. Now that you are going doing the thing, Oh, these are their own batteries. People, nah. -uh. No, people are gonna come and be like, yeah, because people will come and be like, I think Kelsey annoys Danny a lot and stuff, and now he'll be like, see, she annoys him. What? That if people come all the time, they're like, um, I think Kelsey annoys Danny a lot, and like. I don't even read the comments. They'll be like, "Do you see his face? He looks annoyed with her all the time, or something." And I'm just like. I don't think besides the one video I read, like all the comments about people wanting Matthew to vlog. Yeah. Um. Besides that, would you did you put it? Never mind. Um, I haven't really read any comments since like February. I read the comments and I do try to answer them, but. It's a lot of comments, so... I mean, I used to read every single one. I try to comment on every single one, but now it's just like... It's getting overwhelming. Yeah. I just don't even do it now, because there's no point. Especially because there's a lot of rude comments now. I know you read them all. Yeah, Most but I don't, I don't let them bother me. Some people might let them bother them, but not I. 
I no. don't have time for that, you know. I need to read my knock. 